Hi, it's Eric, and we're going to talk about what I think is the best one brand, two watch collection you can buy. Yes, it's a Seiko product, specifically a Grand Seiko. Uh, Spring Drive and the Marine Master 300, which if you've watched this channel before, you may know that. Um, you may not know that I'm a really big Tudor fan, and I've had four Tudors. I love Tudor. The problem with having a watch collection that's a two-watch collection with Tudor is they really don't have a dress watch. I um, have plenty that you could wear, but a specific dress watch, no. And I would say that the Spring Drive, fantastic. The, the Grand Seiko dials, everything about it screams class, luxury, and you can use it as a dress watch or you can use it as an everyday watch Monday through Friday. Of course, the Marine Master 300 is very specific and I, I think it's the best dive watch you can buy. Uh, so we'll take a closer look right now. So here we are, the ultimate two watch collection. I know people are going to go, oh my God, Seiko. Listen, it's Grand Seiko and it's Seiko Marine Master. It's not just Seiko. And in fact, you know, look, Seiko started in 1888, long before Rolex ever did. I don't want to get into that, but I will get into some of the facts about this, that this spring drive is really the most accurate watch you can get outside of a quartz watch. So it has the mechanics as well as the regulation to help that, uh, that hand sweep like that. I'm not going to get into the specifics of how a spring drive works. I'm sure you either know or can look that up. The thing I will get into is how beautiful this watch is. This watch is really gorgeous uh, when it comes to the dial and when it comes to everything, the finishing, the flatness of the dial is even just beautiful. The sword hands, and there is nothing you can find wrong with this. You know, I can always find some type of burr or something on a hand or somewhere, even in Tudors, but this watch is like, it's really crazy how beautiful this watch is. And the Zeratsu polishing, and also the bracelet is really just a gorgeous bracelet. Uh, I know people have issues with Grand Seiko bracelets. I don't. Uh, I specifically like that this bracelet doesn't have that one link that's that's highly polished. Uh, so this is the 429, I believe. And I think this is the most affordable Grand Seiko spring drive that you can get. And uh, I think it's new 4600, I want to say. I don't buy new. I just get that on the secondary market or look for it. And of course, this one needs no introduction, especially if you watched my channel before. The Marine Master 300, it is a crazy, crazy watch. It's um, a 300 meter watch, but um, just amazing in every way. And I know a lot of people don't like it. You're hearing uh, ambulance or something outside. It's New York. I can't help it. I, if you know this already, if you've seen this channel, I love this uh, bezel action. It, I can easily place it and it has that friction with rubber underneath it. People wonder why it feels that way. It feels that way specifically because there are rubber o-ring inside and it has two click springs. So it's more of a friction and glide. It's just beautiful. It's really an amazing, amazing um, bezel. The other things about the watch, I... I think that the bracelet's fine. I just prefer to use this Crafter Blue blue bracelet. Um, as you can see, even the polishing is great. It has Dia Shield. I've had this watch and I beat this watch and I don't have any scratches still. I wear it every day. I wear this thing to bed at night because of the loom and I wake up and I wanna know what time it is so I just look at my watch. And then people say, you know, it's too heavy. Come on, come on. Um, and I love that the Crafter Blue accepts the, um, the Seiko. Um, clasp. I know people don't like it. Yeah, it is uh, It is not a milled clasp, but what's cool about it is this. That's a serious extension. For a diver, that's a real dive extension. Uh, that is by far the longest one I know in the market. Um, I think it's fantastic. And, you know, during the day, if your wrist expands, it comes out a little bit. Does it look super beautiful? No, it's not. It's a tool watch. It's a tool watch. Uh, but, you know, it's, 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 I think, a really great system that obviously they haven't changed. So I don't know if there's much more to talk about. Um, I don't know. I, I guess people will argue uh, the point that there could be, uh, you know, you look at Rolex Oyster Perpetual versus uh, also uh, a Rolex Submariner. For me, I think you know my thoughts. This beats the Oyster Perpetual to death. I mean, come on. Are you kidding me? This thing doesn't lose time. I mean, it's a couple of seconds a month and it's beautiful. And the sweep is beautiful. And this thing, this is a bulldozer. This thing's a bulldozer. It's beautiful though. I mean, I love it. I love wearing this watch. So there's a two watch collection. This, as you know, is unbeatable. This thing will just, can't be beaten. The best loom, I think, of any watch in the world, if you ask my opinion, um, consistently. 
So Luma Bright from Seiko, and that's your Loom shot. And the Marine Master on a seven inch wrist. It's thick, but I think it still looks great. I think it still looks great. Let's see it on a suit. And here it is on a suit and cuff fits around it. And I know a lot of people wouldn't wear it to work. I would, I just don't care. And I think it looks great. So there you go. Here's the Grand Seiko on a seven inch wrist. I don't think this was needed, but it's a 40 and it looks beautiful and even better on a suit. And here it is on a suit, obviously. <laughs> this thing looks beautiful, of course. So there we go, let's go back up top. So there you have it. I think that this is the easily the best two watch one brand collection. It's hard to do that with a brand. You know, I want to choose one from a dress a dress watch. I want to choose one that's uh, a dive watch or a tool watch. But this company, if you go to Grand Seiko, they provide that dress watch that's absolutely amazing with ridiculous accuracy and uh, workmanship. And the same with the Marine Master 300. You can use it as a beater with a Dia Shield. The one I have is used and still looks great. Uh, so I think both of the watches are fantastic. And to do a two watch one brand. Um, a collection, I think it's perfect. So thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe.